This is James with First Updates Now here at the South Florida Regional. I'm here with Rookie Sensation 9404 Ford. We're going to go over this amazing rookie robot and just how they went about the game this year today on Behind the Bumpers. This video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following. Discover how Kettering University students engineer their success with Kettering's amazing co-op employment programs where students earn great pay and gain valuable experience. Those accepted into Kettering University can apply for a robotic scholarship providing up to an additional $5,000 a year in tuition assistance. Head on over to kettering.edu slash first to learn more and apply. Support funds content creators when you sign up for a membership on YouTube Join. You'll get access to special perks like emotes, loyalty badges, and fund members will even get early access to our scheduled videos and more. 100% of this revenue will go back to our correspondents to help recognize their efforts. Click the join button in any YouTube video to pledge your support. All right, starting us off is going to be Alexis, who's going to go over their drivetrain. So to start off, we have four full Neos on a Mark IV Swerve Pod for our propulsional direction. And then we have four uh, Neo 550s to uh, rotate our reels wherever we need to be. Pretty simple. And then we'll move on to our intake. So our intake folds out and deploys onto the ground. And then we, if we have a note on the ground, we'll run the intake, we'll grab it, and then we flip it back in. We flip it back in. And then we'll run our shooters beforehand. Start them. So this intake is, uh, the rollers are run by two uh, Neo 550s, each with stages on them. And then our flipping mechanism is run by two full Neos on each side with gears here to flip the bar. And then our shooter is run by two Neo Vortexes, one on each side, and they have bands behind them to connect to the top wheels. So they run simultaneously on each side. Next, we have our climbing mechanism. And we start here in this position with our pins in, and then we'll raise it up all the way to our max height. Then we'll stop it, and then we'll bring it back down to grab onto that chain. And th these are also run by two full Neos, on each, one on each side. And then I'll hand it off to Kristen to talk about the code. So right now we have a command-based programming and we actually have on our intake here, we have PID control that we were able to get working. So now, because originally our um, intake was slamming into our robot, so now we actually have it that it'll gently come down and then shoot off. We also have PID on our shooter and it makes all of our, shoot all of our shoots really accurate. In addition, um, with our auto, we normally can shoot on any side of the speaker, so either left, right, or center. Um, and we consistently shoot um, our note into the speaker. All right, very impressive, especially for a rookie year. I do see we have a camera here. Have you guys been working on any camera tracking or anything like that? Yes, um, so we usually use our front camera just in general because we actually can see like our whole like front of our robot in addition like if we're like behind the stage or anything and we can't see. Um, we also have our limelight in the back of the robot that helps with tracking in addition and it also serves as a second camera for our other side of the robot. Um, and yeah. All right, uh, one final question. You guys have another event later on in the year. Is there any improvements you're looking to make, whether it's mechanical, coding, or just driver consistency? Um, we probably want to add another note into our auto, so probably uh, driving out, grabbing the note, and then coming back. So basically just trying to grab two notes. Um, and then I think mechanical-wise, we probably want to try to get um, our intake more accurate because we've been having like a little bit of trouble with that so definitely those two all right well especially for a rookie year this is super impressive um i really look forward to seeing how you guys do for the rest of the season and hope you guys make it really far thank you all right this is james with first updates now signing off this video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following 
Discover how Kettering University students engineer their success with Kettering's amazing co-op employment programs where students earn great pay and gain valuable experience. Those accepted into Kettering University can apply for a robotic scholarship providing up to an additional $5,000 a year in tuition assistance. Head on over to Kettering.edu first to learn more and apply.